10 metres out and straight in front. Puts it through. Carlton still a long way from uh, victory. I think Footscray are going to hang on and win this one. Coming up to the 22 minute mark. There's the score. Still, uh, Carlton need three goals to be close to Footscray. And I doubt if they can do it. 84 marks to Carlton. 79 to Footscray, so it's been a very even battle as far as marks are concerned. This is the third football of the day coming out. Two have been lost. Stoneham for Footscray. Not a good hand pass, but it finishes with McGee. D in turn uh, finds Rasmussen with a short pass. Rasmussen's kick finds Byrne underneath it. He spills a mark. Upends his opponent. Wilkins. Now Brown. Finally Rasmussen. Screws it back. But Ben Waite is standing there. Slightly unnecessary. Australia brought on Abbey. I think uh, I don't think Vin White's putting that on at all. He's, he's got uh, that, that they hurt, especially when you get a knee in the back like that. He's kicked it well enough. Thorpe kicks it back from whence it came. White holds the mark. Austin. Good bump by Nichols and a palm forward to Walls. And through for a behind. Jones uh, shepherded Walsh out of the way, but it was only the minor score. So that's the three straight goals. Off the ground comes Steele for Footscray. His place taken by Abbey. Casey, the back pocket player, kicks it in. And that's a fine mark by David Mackay of Carlton. His 12th. And some great high marking, and Mackay kicks it tremendously long, but for another behind to Carlton. And that, by my reckoning, makes it 17 points the difference. With Carlton now 8 goals, 10, 58, and Footscray 10, 15, 75. Coming up to the extra time period now. So Carlton still need three straight goals if they're going to win this, but I can't see them doing that. It's a mark to Footscray, or a free kick. The man to take it is Adrian Gallic. Been a great player for the Bulldogs today. He's having his 29th kick. Playing against his uh, former team, Carlton. He's certainly done really well. Crane for Carl. Marks that one out of the pack. Time ticking away, 25 and a half minutes. Footscray, 17 points in front. Armstrong now in trouble, out of trouble, screws it back. Well done. The Southby who came in to smother there and smothered very well and strongly and threw for a behind so it's 16 points the difference and very few in the crowd have left 26 minutes gone I don't think this will be a terribly long quarter out ball knocked forward in goes Nichols with a good side bump Gallagher wins his 20th or 30th kick Crane underneath it can't mark Gingell the chance for Footscray White taps it on Theo has the chance Salmon brilliant White 
Roberts with the free kick. Coming up to the 27 minute mark. Stray scouting the crumbs better. Power. Southby. Out of the back. It's out of bounds for a throw in. Right beside the behind post. 27 minutes gone. Footscray leading. And Gallagher again for Footscray. 31st kick. Dual can't mark. Rasmussen goes on with it. Sanderlands, that's the full four. Right out there on the centre wing. Sanderlands has got cramp, I think. And he's been penalised for deliberately putting the ball out of bounds. Crosswell taking the free kick. He's now playing at full back for Carlton with Southby at full forward. Nichols has the chance there, but the ball's on the ground. It's picked up by Keogh. And a Carlton mark to Robert Walls. That's his eighth mark. Carlton are down by 16 points. The goal here to Walls could make it 10. Sandilands has been replaced with the crap. Meanwhile, Walls kicks the goal and puts it through. That's his second goal. He's uh, picked one in each half. And the time, 28 and a half minutes and 10 points the difference. Now Footscray have a battle on their hands, but I fancy they've uh, got enough time up their sleeves. about a minute to go. Carlton still need two goals. I don't think they can do it. Stray should win this one. Duel will send Carlton deep into attack. Quinlan and Welsh. Walsh breaks Southby's tackle. Kicks it long. And out for a throw in. That's exactly what they want. It's out of bounds on the centre wing. Siren about to go at any moment. Mackay gets his fist to the ball. Gallagher gets his 30-second kick. Crosswell playing Ducks and Drakes. To Armstrong. Armstrong being told in no uncertain terms to get on with it. Mackay and company and Quinlan behind to defend and kick it out to the flanks once again. get to it 30 minutes gone Footscray must surely win Mackay handball to Armstrong kick it anywhere he did walls in front but can't mark Jackson kicks it quickly Southby struggling for position balls on the ground Southby does it well gets caught handball to walls walls straightens up and he's offline Behind only. 30 and a half minutes gone. Nine points the difference. And Footscray must surely win this game. They were they led by as many as 32 points. Carlton have reduced it to nine, but Footscray's game this one, and they thoroughly deserved it because they want wanted the ball more. Carlton breaking away. Brain once again in short. Casey defending as he has well all day. That's a saving mark. Rasmussen. 31 minutes gone. And Footscray in the upset of the day at the Western Oval. Beat Carlton. The final scores. Footscray 10, 15, 75. Carlton 9, 12, 66.